Now I'm gonna show you guys a very effective sweep against one of the most popular pass of the guard that uh, I have seen so many times. I have uh, tried myself, my brothers, Alexander, and then I, I figured out that uh, if you have the right spot, you can really be amazed in this sweep. You don't have to worry about the pass. So basically, Stanny, he goes for the pass, crossing the knee, grab my collar, go here, and bam, go for the pass. That's a very, very effective pass if you don't know how to defend because the most of the people that go for the pass. When he tried start to pass, they try to turn the body and push the guy. When you push the guy, you give exactly what he wants to go for the pass. Or go. When you lock here, if you try to pull your body, you can stay in the right spot and look how he can drive easily the knee through. Make it very easy for him to do that. So now we're going to start to see, break the details because that's, if you miss one part, it's going to be really hard for you and you're going to have to spend a lot of energy and you're going to lock yourself into doing that. So he's going to start to go for the pass. He reached that. Look, right here. Here's the first part. As soon as he dropped the knee, my leg has to lock under him. So move this side. As soon as he crossed, and he, look my leg, is right here. I'm blocking here. If I let my leg flat, makes it too easy for him to cross. Here, when he starts to cross, cross. He don't cross because I lock him right here. Okay? Other side. So he's here, he crossed the knee, I lock. And now look. He's doing the grip. I'm going to make the same grip as him. So I'm going to grab here and his collar. And now it's very important the momentum of the position. As soon as he starts to push the knee, look, look how he's driving his way. Look how he's driving his knee. That's the momentum that I'm going to move. Go. Look, look, look. Go over him. What I'm doing here. I'm exactly following him. When, he, when he's driving his knee through, I'm just following him over. I make like a roll with him. And as much as he go deep, it's easier for me to roll for the position. We have play guard, he crossed the knee. Look, this grip here is very important because I don't let him put his weight down. Look, I block him too. I'm always blocking. I have to worry about that because if I just stay here, he can go lower and I don't have too much angle to insist. So as soon as I'm here, I grab. When he, I feel that he's pushing the knee, look. That's the time that I make the sweep. So I'm here. He goes, I reach, reach, lock the leg, he passed the knee, look how easy it is. And finish the swim. You don't have to worry, sometimes you have the feeling that he's gonna keep going, passing the guard, but he's not, because you wanna use his lever to sweep. Now you're gonna do in a real speed, and you're gonna be how easy it is to drive your body. And also, you don't pull the guy, you just drive. The arms move like this. And your body just go around. So he's go, go, finish. One more time. The other side. So, if you miss, go. 
if you miss the knee here and he bend now, don't go more for that. Don't go because you don't have the leverage. Your, your leg has to trap here. If you don't trap, don't go for that. That's the main thing. So you have to make sure he's here because look how easy it is. Look, you see, I don't even need to move with him. I just do with the hands and also I move with my body. So when you are 100% sure, boom, you get the lock. Now it's just a piece of cake. Go. And I can go with him or not. And I have to take my brother to doing that because Shani Ribeiro showed me a little bit how to do that and now improve that. And that's what it's about. We have to exchange information. I think that's going to be really good for you guys to know that.